Matt Duncan. Uh, I'm at Rhode Island College. I'm an assistant professor there. A lot of my past work is on what we people are, most fundamentally, and also how we know our own minds. But uh, most recently, I've been working on a certain kind of knowledge, uh, knowledge of things that's non-propositional, it's different from other kinds of knowledge, that perception would be a good case. So I think this in itself counts as a kind of knowledge. The talk is on a particular kind of knowledge and uh, it's a tricky kind of knowledge. So it's a, knowledge, it's a kind of knowledge that I think we all have, but it's difficult to characterize in terms of what it is that we know. Uh, one example might be, uh, you can imagine the first time you tasted a raspberry. You learn something new, um, but try and tease out what exactly it is that you know or try to describe that, and it's going to be difficult to exhaust all that you knew in that case. I'm gonna talk about that kind of uh, knowledge and discuss it and um, show that there are some very common assumptions in philosophy today about what is required for knowledge that don't fit super well with that kind of knowledge. And then I'm going to look at some alternative um, ways of thinking about that knowledge.